one thing I always tell folks who are thinking of Jones Day is mm -hmm. the things that might get you rewarded at other large law firms could actually set you back at Jones Day. So for example, if you're at another large law firm and taking credit for a client may get you a promotion or may get you additional compensation, that's not how it works at Jones Day. They're all clients of the firm. And that type of maneuvering that happens at the partner level, certainly at other law firms, whether it's vying for the clients or trying to get yourself involved in a case that you probably shouldn't be a part of, that does not exist at Jones Day. They're all clients of the firm, and when it comes to staffing, the best lawyers for that project are put on the case. I would say two things. Number one, it makes coming into the office a lot easier. You, you don't feel like you have to play the political game with your partners, which by the definition of partner, you shouldn't have to, right? But that happens at a lot of large law firms. So you can focus on what you need to do as a lawyer. Secondly, all of that results in better client service because I don't feel the pressure, for example, if we have a particular case that comes in to try to get myself on that case just to keep busy. The firm doesn't reward that kind of conduct. What they reward is, are you doing everything that you can do in the best interest of the client? So if a new case comes in, they're going to assign the person that makes the most sense to be on that case. So number one, it just makes it a lot easier because there's not political elements out that you may see at other large law firms. But secondly, it allows you to focus on the thing that is the most important and why this law firm exists, and that is to service clients.